Welcome everyone to today's overview of Curio Control NG100 Unified Thread Management Solution. This video is brought to you by 2A Solve, services and consulting for personal computer, networking, and data storage. Once you log into the management interface, the first screen you will see is the dashboard. This is where we can see the system status, the uptime, if the system is up to date, and if all the services are working properly. Scrolling down, we have a graph that shows the last 30 minutes of RAM and CPU utilization, as well as internet access. The next page shows us interfaces. The top part of the screen lets us see that Kirio Control is connected to the internet via a single link. Below, we can see the status for the internet interface and the internal LAN, also known as the Trusted Local Interface. Curio Control acts as a VPN server, allowing us to connect from remote clients and allowing us to define VPN connections to other Curio systems. The next page lets us customize traffic rules, which are a list of services and products that we can decide whether or not are allowed inbound or outbound of our network. Anything that does not fall into any of these categories will be automatically rejected. The intrusion prevention monitors detects possible attacks on specific ports or services based on a database of signatures. According to the severity of the incident, low, medium, or high, we can decide whether we want to log, drop, or simply ignore the activity. The database is constantly updated and the system will check for modification every 24 hours. Security settings add an additional layer of protection. MAC filtering allows or denies access to the network based on the defined network MAC address. GeoIP filter can block access from single countries based on IP addresses. In this, in this example, we can block all traffic coming from Antarctica. Next, we have bandwidth management and QoS. This page allows us to reserve a certain bandwidth for a specific service, such as a voice over IP. Another way to protect your network is by defining a specific content filter. Some filters are predefined by carrier control, such as well-known compromised websites including phishing and fraud sites. Another option available is the blocking of peer-to-peer -peer traffic. Double-clicking on the detected content column will provide access to the full list of applications and web categories that can be selected. Curio Control integrates Sophos Antivirus that looks over both web traffic and email. There is also the classic DHCP server where a mix of dynamic and static IP addresses can be selected. We hope you enjoyed this video, and if you did, please leave a like and subscribe. Also, feel free to contact us with any questions. Thank you.